Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're coming here for the first time, consider hitting the subscribe button real quick and rate rock and roll. In today's video, I'm going to give you the full overview on the utility software called Mini Tool Partition Wizard. I got one from them for the demonstration purposes and thanks to them for making this video possible. We know in the world of computer, we always need to keep our workflow clean and neat. In that case, we are more likely to find a proper way to organize our files, documents, etc. In that case, that's why we need to divide our resources into small parts so as to be able to manage, control, and troubleshoot where there is an issue. By trying to bring the same concept in computing, we like to perform what we call disk partitioning. Disk partitioning is the act of taking one disk and subdivide it into smaller manageable spaces and it is very helpful when you want to store files in the specified and easy to remember location. By using Windows or Mac computers, they include default disk utilities that helps us to perform the basic actions of partitioning. But the limitations are so high. That is where the many tool partition wizard come into play and you will have to use the right tool for the right job. The Mini Tool Partition Wizard is a software that helps us to organize the disk partitions and get the proper performance of our disks. It ensures the flexibility and there is no limit on what you can do on your disks including the encrypted ones. It works in all Windows operating systems including the Windows Server operating systems. Let's jump to the official website and see all the features and how you can get it. It can perform various actions on our disk including Create, delete or format partitions. Uh, when you want to create or delete partition in simple steps, format in accessible hard drive, convert to RAW or to NFTC uh, in order to revive your hard disk, this is the best tool to go with. It also helps us to move or resize the partition. Uh, when you want to move non adjacent partition together for extending purposes, it enlarge our specific disk uh, to remove the low disk space warnings. It can help us also to wipe the disk partitions and when it's used to wipe the disk partitions you will never never be able to recover any data when you don't want to recover that data. So this tool is very very amazing. And it can also perform what we call the merge split partitions. Uh, that's where we want to combine uh, two partitions into one partition without losing any data. And the other feature that it offers is to convert FAT to NTA face. And if you want to convert the file system real quick, you can use this tool and you can get the advantage of it. And it can also copy the disk partition and uh, it can uh, copy what record on the system disk and it can be performing all this when you go the pro edition. And it can also perform what we call the benchmark disk partition surface test space analyzer you can visit the website and you can explore more when you scroll down there will be somewhere when we can see all the pricings or know how we can get this software there is a free for lifetime there is a 59 usd for annual subscription and there is what you call this is for the pro and this is for the pro platinum where you can you we can they pay $109 for the annual subscription and you can get all these ones. So I have, uh, I got the lesson from Minitool. So I'm going to download the freeware and try to install in my system and I will activate it using the license that I have been provided. So uh, let me go ahead and uh, download this one real quick and download this very easy Can download this and the uh, speed can change up on your internet speed and I'm going to utilize it in my PC Let me minimize this one and the installation is very simple anyone can proceed with the installation in very very simple steps uh, let me go ahead and press next okay and I press um, here to now uh, telling me the for the components in the product I really have to press next and this is the installation folder i can leave it as it is i will press next again and it will download the dependencies and it doesn't take long i can speed up so that no ever make this video so huge and there we go and as you can see now the installation have been completely uh, successful and so i will go ahead and click on finish and uh, in this case 
I think to open it itself like this one and to give me this nice interface and the welcome screen which is also telling me to get the license I'm gonna get a, a little of that and as you can see this is now the actual screen on all this one and when we want to check for the uh, let me go ahead and check for the uh, the, the current version and you can see now I have this uh, petition wizard and uh, I'm going to move from the free version to the licensed version and I think I will use uh, let me check for this I will go here on the register and as you can see on the bottom there is where I can uh, paste or put in my license code and as I have them, I'm going to copy them and paste them real quick so as to never make things complicated. I'm going to censor this one and I will try and paste my license up here and I will click on upgrade. And you can see now they tell me that uh, they thanked me for the registration. And yeah, I'm now going to have the fun around with the four. Um, service and you can see it is now the with the lifetime upgrade service so when i go ahead and go on help and on about you can see now i have i have the pro ultimate so uh there is a ton of things that we can perform on our hard disks and as you can see we can migrate our OS to the SSD we can copy the partition wizard here now we can copy our disk we can partition our disk we can and let me exit here we can convert our disk from GPT to MBR that is very uh, important because these are the basic things that you have to configure on the disk and we can also wipe our disk and as you can see to give me the warning that you can you can wipe our disk if you click on yes in this case we don't want to wipe our disk so we are going to click no and there is an option to delete all the partitions and there is now um, another partition recovery you can see all of these uh, good features in this software you can go on the disk properties to analyze all the disk properties you can see the device name the head the sector per track the bytes per sector the total size and all the other things you can go on the all of this you can see it offers many things here uh, you can also click on one partition and explore here on partition there is another things you can uh, access real quick in here and you can see all the things uh, you can check the size you can use this space analyzer you can scan and you can tell you the used and the free space and all the fun stuff you can perform using this software and as you have seen you can perform a ton of things using this tool and it is very 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 important and very useful i have tested it myself and i have seen the best of it and before we put this video to an end i would like to recommend Minitool to bring the support for mac os users because they have to enjoy the features as well and this mark the end of my video i hope guys you find this interesting and if you find this interesting strap the like button if you are excited and if you are coming on this channel for the first time press the subscribe button once it's free and special thanks to Minitool for making this video possible I will see you guys in another video. Ciao!